like this. I want like to tell you I have full blown goosebumps. It's more like geese bumps at the moment. Uh, to cope with the increased rent and living costs, you decide to participate in paid medical trials run by your university. You agree to enter trial testing for a drug called Veritol, which has been developed to enhance human comprehension of abstract concepts. You have been told to wait inside a doctor's office that contains a two-way mirror and to listen to a tape that will play a random series. After a, seri a certain amount of time, you are to report any changes in mood or perception to a team of pharma pharmacological. That's, that's. During your application process, they ask you one question that you caught you off guard. Are you happy with your life? Ooh, that's a good question. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go with yes. Sure. I'm not where I want to be in my life. Okay, but we're getting there, baby. I keep trucking along. Very tall trial six. You will be played a series of numbers from one to a thousand. Mm -hmm. The numbers will be read out in no particular order. Got it. Please relax and take a seat. Take a After seat. After the trial is finished, a doctor will ask you whether you had a strong or notable reaction to any particular number. Gotcha. This trial will take between five and fifteen minutes to complete. Up, down, up, down. Number down, set five. Down. Okay. Six hundred seventy-six. Three hundred sixty-two. Was ready's down. Two hundred seventy-eight. Thirteen. Nine hundred twenty-seven. I feel like it's ready's down. Four hundred fifty. Twenty. Huh? Six hundred thirty-four. Three hundred twenty-three. Seventy-one. Two hundred twenty. One hundred fifty-two. 152. Don't trust the voice. 639. 639. 300. 300. 381. Oh, this, this is different. 156. Okay. 717. Right? 8,486. Happening. <gasps> the couch now. What? Okay. Are we alone? Uh. What? Turn around. I don't want to. Oh my god, are you freaking joking me? What is this thing? Hi, sir. Are you made of Play Doh? I can no, I don't I can't see. Uh, uh, that was dude that was so confusing. Where are we going? Are you joking? I don't know I don't know what's happening. Doors open. Looks like we're in like an office. I thought I thought that I'd bring you here. Okay. We used to read here every evening. Me and him. Huh? I swear, I swear it all changed. Right. When we were here, you know, we were happy. Pick anything we didn't up. have a lot of money, but, but I had my job. It, it meant that for our anniversary or for my birthday, he'd make something, you know? He wrote. He was <laughs> a poet. He was okay. In one of his cards, maybe it was my birthday, he, he he wrote something nice. That's good. In truth, I didn't care for a lot of what he wrote, but this, this, this stuck with me. It was one line, mainly. I, I think it went, Given your heart and mine, who could tell the difference? Oh, I didn't read any of that. Make me smile. Are they invisible, man? I don't like this. I, I don't know. It, it all started to change. I, I thought maybe if I brought you here, you'd Blood right understand. there. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like no it. One who I don't I like this. To I have goosebumps. Don't like it. One night, I, I, I think it's more like still a... still felt it between I don't know. us when it was still fresh. He came home and he was so drunk. He 
he was out with his friends from university. They all liked to drink, and I didn't like the whole going out thing. We were different like that. I remember he came in crying, but in a way where he was... He was just... Is that blood right down, there? Breathing in this way I'd never even seen before. Can't do anything. What do you do when the person you love is... Those are just listen, I'm pretty sure. Out right of my corner, of safety. I what to do with him. I hadn't seen him like this. Something happened st stupid. I asked him what was wrong. He said there was an argument and a fight. And then he told me, as best he could with all the tears, he said that he just wants to go to a place where nobody knows him. Something about it was so wrong. I felt it in my core. Something in that moment changed. Me? I'm not to talk, I so... Want to go to a place where Sorry. everybody knows me. The moment you know you can't come back, it's over. If people have crazy ways of thinking about death, but if something dies, it's gone. I've felt it. And no matter what people say, no matter the lies that they tell themselves, there's no coming back. He was just so weak. And I began to ask myself, is this the best that I can do? I know it for sure, when one night when we were in bed, he asked me, what's the naughtiest thing you've ever done? And of course I couldn't tell him, but when he told me, I knew it was done. And I felt so sorry for him. I don't like this. With him was the I don't like to tell you I have full-blown goosebumps. It's more like geese bumps at the moment. I think he even thought I needed it like he needed it. I started staying at work later. I, I joined night classes. I didn't want to see him. It, it was sad that I couldn't enjoy him anymore, but it was liberating too. With every hair he lost, now I felt closer to him. I started having an affair because God knows I couldn't get it from him. And when I came home, every time he opened the door, he looked a little sadder. He started waking up to moonlight. He started drinking, and I was happy again. Run! I knew he had to go. He could never leave me. That's the what? Thing. It made me happy seeing him like that. But eventually he stopped getting worse and just flattered. It wasn't fun. 152. Can't pay the notes up or anything. One fifty two. Do that once it's in your uh, body, your power's against it. Clinic alone, afraid in dissipating mortality, vulnerability, 132 or 634, especially effective. You can see them, come over here. Welcome to my world. Always smelling, no choice. You're next, I see you, but no eyes. How did I lose them? Say traditional warm comfort, red equals love, handwritten, card is personal. Knock, why would they knock? Why would they tell you to run? Should you run? Needs work. Okay. Are you being kept out or is it being kept in? Took away just Justin's ability to love vi and vitality. Modelin. 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 Ritual. Taking the drug prepares you. Tenderizes. Needs work. What's that about? I just heard something. I want you to be here. I'm in your computer. I'm in your in your headphones soon. Justin, Emma, just John, Adam. John was the easiest. In W. Ascension, heaven to you. Telephone, distance and personal betrayal unsafe is yours.
Wait, what does it say? In your presence. Sound that drives you insane. Clinic room 152. Okay, so we've done all of these notes. Every single one of them. Now, something unlocked, it sounded like. Can I crouch? Can I go downstairs? Here we go. I, that, that, I thought that was something. Emma's letter. Letter object debug.log Emma's letter. Dear Justin. I thought about writing this letter a thousand times. It's been so long. You know, I think about the time that's passed and how it wouldn't matter at all if I saw you tomorrow. I wanted to let you know that my silence doesn't reflect anything other than my indecision. I think of you often, every time that I hear your name. See the places that we've been? You can catch a glimpse of someone with your likeness. In my head, I'm 18 again, with you. I was in love with you the first day I met you, but I know I was the first day that I knew you. But I think about the other side of it all too. I have to. You can't be together because we know how it ends. I'm so sorry. I still mourn for us and I wouldn't trade our time for anything. I wouldn't be who I am without you. And Justin, if there's one thing that I want you to know, Just know that I forgive you. Okay. I saw a photo of myself and I didn't recognize a thing. Opening May 2020. What is that thing? Corner 2020, code on canvas. The subject, uh, terrified of the idea that he has lost control of his mind, finds solace in the shelter of a nook. That's what we saw the first time we took the pills or whatever. Go in here. What? For this piece, I was interested in the idea of helplessness against change. What do we fear more than what we can't control? Yeah, we were all here. This isn't a bad yet. Too thin. Okay. What is going on? We're definitely here. Need something else on this side, just like another chest of, of drawers. I don't want it to look something or samey though. Okay. We got that note as well. Wait, did we read this note yet? Just as in Rot, I wanted to explore the horror of lost love. The idea that your love could only one day turn into mal maleficence is unthinkable and was challenging to uh, confront this concept. I did play Rot, and that's a good game. Recommend it. Look at this freaking weird thing. What is that? What is that? I don't like that. Is there a despair any worse than heartbreak? Is there any other madness like it? This game feel I feel is best played alone in the dark. It just makes it a better experience. Anyways, I really love this game. It's shorter than but it honestly really sucked me in. Third section in the dark hallways made me genuinely scared to run around every corner. When I saw a him. That on the ground, a huge chill went up my spine. I find that the repeating text on the walls near the end of the hallway be pretty creepy. I love the storytelling aspect. I love how it actually makes me scared. Great game. Rot felt like it was written by a sad boy stuck in his self-pity after his girlfriend broke up with him, trying to blame her for him going insane. To be fair, the male ego is indeed a scary thing. Context. Textures, monsters, head, and them, blue point lights. Okay. I don't like that. Don't look at me. Oh my god. Error 52. Players on uh, players aware. What the f 
Yo, what is this, man? This is crazy. Dude, this is how an indie game should be, man. This is what this is this right here. This. A story. Something that gets you sucked in that you don't know what's happening. Like this. This is nutty. But this is the thing that we were in. Is that one room. Just... I'm confused, but I kind of know what happens. I don't want to, like, tell a story because I want you guys to inter interpret it the way that you guys would interpret it. And then let me know in the comments what you think, and then we can discuss it. This is definitely a discuss a discussing game, or you what you think what it means. I think I know what it means. So confused. Oh, there we go. I thought I was I thought I was broke. Okay, just gonna keep doing that, huh? run faster what home I'm gonna keep running towards that little white light at the end here and just see what I what happens I'm gonna guess that's the ending but I'm not sure to be fair or to be honest Man, look at this place. This is definitely a, uh... This is a roller coaster of emotions, to be honest. Okay. I really hope this is not copyrighted. Look like memories. Some kind. Thing looking at me? I'm not sure. Can't tell. Maybe? What is this? A little nugget. A gold nugget. I'm, I'm in just awe. Like, I have no commentary. Like, I don't... I'm just confused. I said, what the hell is happening? Gonna fade to black? By Michael Bernardi. Bro. That was fire. I don't know what that was, but that was fire. I, I'm in loss for words. That was great. All right, guys. I don't even know the name of this song or this, this this game. We don't talk about it. All right, guys. That was we don't talk about it. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing. Like, comment, subscribe, and tell your friends. And as I mean, I'll, I might as well, if you, my name's Johnny, and I'll see you guys in the next video. That was crazy.